What is the best advice for your portfolio? Design, motion graphics reel, or whatever. For me, it was following. Your portfolio is only as good as the worst thing in it. Think about it. When you are watching a reel, and it was awesome, really good stuff, and at some point there was something bad. Bad or weird, like a bad font, bad typography, or just a bad stuff. You immediately forgot about the good stuff and started thinking, why the hell did the guy put it there? And from the client's perspective, you're watching a reel of somebody you want to work with. You see good stuff, and then you see something not as good. You may automatically start thinking, if I would work with this guy, he could do the good stuff, but he also can do stuff like this, like the bad stuff, you know, so you're not sure if the guy would deliver. <laughs> the point is that if you are putting together a portfolio or a motion graphics reel, never put there stuff that you are not sure it should be there. For example, in a reel, if you have a music and you have an empty spot that you want to fill, do not put there something just to fill the spot. Put there something good. Never put there something that you are not really sure that it's good. If you have an empty spot and you need to fill it, just do not finish the reel. Create something new. People will probably remember the good stuff, but they will definitely remember the bad stuff. So once again, your portfolio is only as good as the worst thing in it. It's about everything you create and everything you use to present yourself. But if you don't have a reel at all and you would like to create one, or you have a perfect reel and you would like to get three hours of work done in two minutes, check our plugin called Animation Composer. You can download it for free at mrhorse.tv. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.